Hello and welcome back. This is Jen Gruber Mays, Norwest Independent Sales Consultant with the Chicken Demo. So I apologize in advance if you are vegan or vegetarian. Uh, a lot of people are not. We're actually just going to take, this is chicken juice. Uh, the very, very best part of that dang chicken. It's the stuff that might get on your countertop when you're making dinner. I'm going to take a protein swab and see what we have here. This is a test that uh, looks for protein and there will be a chemical reaction if there happens to be protein. Just snap that, shake it up. Yeah, it looks like it's kind of changing. Here is the color code for protein. You can kind of see it's moving its way down the, uh, down the line there. So notice nothing has been cleaned yet. So that is like high protein. Now I'm going to take the EnviroCloth. This is my EnviroCloth that I use in my kitchen. I've had it for over four years. I think this is the first EnviroCloth I ever had. And I'm going to do one swipe of that area. No scrubbing, no nothing. I'm gonna take a second protein swab. And you can see no reaction has happened to that protein swab yet. Get a good sampling of that whole area. I'm really looking to see if I can pick up anything at all. And I'm gonna dunk it back in here. Snap and shake. And you can see pretty quickly that that color is pretty darn green. This end of the scale is no protein. This end of the scale is high protein. So with one swab of the Inverter cloth, we've picked up everything off the surface. And uh, when you've got up all the protein, you've also taken up all the spots that bacteria like to hang out. Now, if we had a little more time, we could actually also show you that the EnviroCloth will pick up 99.9% .9 of the bacteria. That's, and it, so does Clorox. Um, I'll say a little bit more about that in a second. So it will perform as well as Clorox in that area. I also wanna show you though, that uh, one of my compatriots had done an experiment and you may be using some of these other things in your house and it just goes to show that um, this is no product so this is kind of equivalent to the one that we already did and you have varying levels of success with other cleaners now the kind of the upshot is it's not so much the cleaner it's the cloth that you use and uh, with the Norris cloth you're getting everything up and what's happening is it's going into the microfibers and it's not being released again and what's happening inside the microfibers is there is silver. I may have mentioned the silver earlier, but the silver is actually toxic to the bacteria that is being trapped inside those microfibers. So you are getting over time that bacteria being deactivated in your cloth. So you let that dry and you can use your cloth again. Um, so what I want to draw your attention to is, you know, I mentioned that Clorox and Norwex actually can boast 99.9% .9 effectiveness. And if you think about maybe a commercial you've seen for Clorox, it zooms in on your toilet bowl and lo and behold, you've used Clorox and you've got 99.9% .9 clear, but you've got these tiny little bacteria still in the field. If you look carefully, they have to show you that because they can't say 100%. What they don't show you is the next frame. And those tiny little bacteria are now spread across the entire field because you've just wiped out their competition. And not only that, when you try hitting it with Clorox again, it's gonna be less effective. And if you try hitting it twice, three times, four times, your Clorox is gonna get less and less effective and you're actually generating a super bug. When you're working with Norwex, you're still gonna have those few little bacteria, but those are gonna be the garden variety bacteria. So even though they come back, you can have the same effectiveness in cleaning with your Norwex cloth the second time, third time, fourth time, as many times as you want to use your Clorox, or use your Norwex cloth. I can't believe I just said that. <laughs> Plus, you don't gas yourself out in the process. So that is the chicken demo, and in our final shot with the chicken demo, there are various other products, the enzyme line, the household pack where you can get 90% of your cleaning done, and also some of the different colors that you can get of cloths that uh, you can be using in the kitchen, as well as other things. I love this one. This is my favorite uh, go-to dish doing cloth. And of course, the little dust, the, the kid dust mat. Uh, dust mat. 
Anyway, thank you very much for watching, and I look forward to interacting with you back on Facebook.